Of course you will. Because God forbid anybody helps me. Damn it. Show them within 20 seconds. Oh. Oh. Oh, you... Okay, hold on. Let's go out and try again. Guess I need to dash. Take that, Caterpies! Alright. Statue B, right? A choice this is getting a little out of hand literally as in my hands on the controller don't mean anything There was only two statues. Hmm. I don't know why you're following me. The second I go into a cave, you're gonna stand outside. Let's see if they'll let me leave. Nope. Yeah, this whole guiding where you go is getting a little out of hand. Oh, son of a... Statue in the Rye Cliff below the ruins where the spirit's breath cannot reach. The valley wind will lead you to the gold ship. Alright. Uh, yeah, this is the wind. What is it? Uh, where the wind does not reach, or where the breath does not reach. Oh, made a move on me. Ooh. Oh, cool, I can kill those things. Okay, alright, almost at, uh, almost at 100. I want to see what happens here. thingy shoot uh, okay I was on the steps so it didn't let me okay so right there I got a little little one oh that's pretty cool then as long as I'm careful probably build up a decent amount of lives I 
Excellent. A little more defense. Whee! Hmm. That looked like a door. Oh. No time limit, so... I can kill them at my leisure, although taking too long is probably going to be really sort of boring to watch. That's right. Makes it easier to destroy you when you roll up like a ball. Take that, sports. Okay. Can't do anything there. Hmm. I wonder if there's something... Probably something to destroy... Oh, no. Stairs. Woo! Woo! Oh. Easy, mud guy. I say this game actually moves very fluidly. And I apologize if you're getting a lot of the clicking noises. Yeah, it's <laughs> this late into the playthrough is probably a little weird to start apologizing for that, but yeah, I know it can be a little loud. It's for some reason this controller is just kind of like that. Oh, got some life. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hmm. What is this, like... Diamond shit. Okay. What an odd thing to find. Let's go ahead and see what it does here. Diamond shaped. Oh, okay. Uh, there we go. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Cool. I gotta be honest, I'm a little, I'm kind of early into the game, and I'm already kind of wishing I played this a long time ago. That's right. probably, probably get a power later for that. You know, the good thing about this game is it's actually not super expensive. I think I've seen it for, you know, 15, 20 bucks. It's, you know, it's the typical, if you want to get the box and the instructions, that's when it starts to cost you money. But this game actually isn't too bad if you just want to get the cartridge. You know, Soul Blazer was a bit much, even if you get just the cartridge. Uh, that looks like the place to go, so. Oh, not everything. Oh, oh okay, we got a lot of enemies on there. But yeah, Soul Blazer was it was kind of getting up there in price, you know. But Illusion of Gaia still seems pretty low. Uh, okay. Anything? Anything to kill? Okay. Loops back around. Okay, so basically I'm going to... I unlock shortcuts back. Yeah, because when I came in, I think I came in through here. Yeah, okay. Alright, that's pretty cool. 